in country and the word you want to learn is their curse word. Yes, because Umbab. people be moving mad. <laughs> yeah. Mm, what does it mean? Sound like this. What, is, what does it mean? What does it mean? It means stupid. How do you guys call your pa like a pastor? Pastor. <laughs> 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 Hey guys, so I'm so tired. We just got back to our living our, um, house. I didn't give you guys a video for a trip. We road trip from Uganda to Kenya. Hey, it was such a long distance, guys. It was such a long distance. But one thing about it is that it's safe. Like it's really, really very safe to road trip um, in these countries. So I'll just give you guys an update. And this was just literally how my day went today. I met these two uh, interesting Kenyan friends. Um, they're also tour guides. So if you're in Kenya and you're looking for a tour guide, um, they will be the best bet for you. If you're looking for accommodation and places to visit. So they have a, a boat app. So you see this uh, discount I'm being given from yeah, 320 to 200. So at night you'll say, I'm not giving that discount. So you pay me there. So guys, they, they have the boat app. And then the good thing about the boat app is that they have uh, Whenever you're using a boat, please share there. Whenever you're using, just share it with They me. have a boat, and they have a tuk tuk, they have women only, and which is really good. And then they have boda boda, which is a bike, and their prices are quite different. So, depending on the world you want to. Oh, look at this fine one, guys. So, they have a bike. Open it. It's In a hair and beauty salon, there is something called Abuja, which we all know is a city in Nigeria. What is the style? Apparently, this is the Abuja style. Okay. You want they call bike for the border in yeah, Kenya okay, and you can the Okada, not Okay. Then okay, <laughs> okay, they, <laughs> they, they call Matatu our bus, our no, down our buses. Buses is what we call it, the bus. So the bus. We have a difference between massage and bus. So bus what is, is it? a long one. No, bus is not a long one. Everything is bus. Be it long or short, it's good for the bus Imagine for us. Like the small one is matatu. Like the one you use the shuttle hey. with matatu. Guys, they, they, they explain everything how it is. You call it bus regardless. And then they are keke, they call it tuk tuk. Uh, like so, yeah. that tuk tuk. Yeah, like that. That's a tuk tuk. So let's experience their matatu. Guys, we are about to enter the bus in Kenya. They said Matatu, sorry. So let's get in. Bodyguard, please help us with the phone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to eat food at the Kenyan residence. Okay, I'm ready to eat. Here in Kenya, and I'm eating their Ugali. And what is this called? Karanga. Karanga. Beef stew. Beef stew. And Sky is eating their biryani, which is supposed to be rice and chicken stew. biryani. I don't know why the rice is in different colors of the Mekurembo. When we have online battles, maybe Africans find you again and say no. Nigerians and Kenyans are one. Food in every country in Africa except Nigeria. Oh, this is a But when someone talks negative things about Kenya, Nigerians actually fight for us. You people actually unite to fight for us. Uh, the same I way think of recent, of recent, the only Kenyan online I've seen is when they're comparing Kenyan accents with Nigerian accents. People will be like, this is called pastor. How do you guys call your pa like a pastor? Pastor. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Is it easier than pastor? Yeah. Pasta, that's not spaghetti. That is food. Pastor. Pastor. Yeah. Ah, ah, no, but no, no, where do you put all? L? O R. Pastor. Yeah. Where is the pasta coming from? So let's let's. Pasta. Coming from. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? You guys always speak like that. Very long procedure before you get a gun in Kenya. Yeah. There are no procedure. If you meet the requirements, you can own a gun. Yeah. Yeah. Why? Because I have to protect myself, I have to protect my equipment. Actually, most that's business not... owners and rich people, they have guns for their own safety. So I told you, our country is very free. Even in Uganda, they can only go. Yeah. It's crazy and scary. It's not crazy. I literally want to run away because, from the country because okay, you don't where, know there's, where there's human beings, there's always bad people and good people. Are there a lot of gun rapes 
in this country? They really misuse them because uh, we had an accident. We had an accident of a Kenyan member of parliament. He accidentally shot a DJ at the club. You are giving people guns on the assumption that everyone is saying. What is to say that someone will not no, offend me and I bring my gun and like kill someone? If you have guns. Yeah, you people are crazy. That's why you. <laughs> <laughs> I can say it, but you can't. No, you people are. If you've actually noticed our online battles, Kenyans are more like accustomed they to some things. Do they have online battles in Kenya? <laughs> are you guys even online? <laughs> Is that a question? You guys don't have an online, online presence. Are, are you online? Are in Twitter. I, I don't know. I've never seen a Kenya. Kenyans are myth on Twitter, my guy. <laughs> <What? laughs> <laughs> I swear! 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 I swear